participants, uh, introducing David Milan. Um, please, questions one by one. Um, Milan, you had a great session uh, with the uh, Shower Zelmi here. So, how good it was, and how good it to be back here in Pakistan? Yeah, brilliant. Um, the PSL was, I'd say, a stepping stone for me um, out of county cricket to play in a franchise tournament. Um, so, extremely fortunate enough to have been given that opportunity um, to play against the best players in the world. Um, you know, which is slightly different to, to county cricket. Um, so, got given that opportunity. And it sort of taught me what I needed if I wanted to go one step further. Um, so the PSL has been fantastic for myself. It's given me the opportunity to, to better myself as a player. It's given me the opportunity to play in different leagues around the world because I was part of that. Um, and then to be back back in Pakistan has been fantastic. Um, the hospitality has always been unbelievable. We've been welcomed with open arms as we always have, uh, whether it's a, uh, as an overseas for the PSL or um, for England. So, um, yeah, it's great to be back. It's great to be playing cricket here. Malan, you took over Babar Azam as number one T20I batter. So you are much familiar among Pakistani people because uh, that was a, a very big news for here. Uh, first, uh, Josh Butler is missing out on injury. How uh, important he would have been for you guys. And uh, uh, Muin Ali will lead this high. So how you look uh, at this, uh, looking forward to an important series? Yeah, obviously disappointing. Josh is not available um, as captain and probably been our best player in, in this format for, for a few years now, especially since he's moved up the top. Um, so to lose him is not ideal, but it gives an opportunity to other people, it gives an opportunity to Moeen Ali, to, to captain, who's also been fantastic when he's got given that opportunity. Um, you know, I think ultimately the long run is to make sure that those players who aren't quite ready yet are, are peaking for the World Cup. Um, you know, so it gives us an opportunity to build towards that and, and build our way up um, to be able, when we hit the ground running in Australia, that everyone's fit um, and, and playing good cricket. Um, but ultimately, we're here to win the series. We're here to, to play as well as we can, and we're here to give people opportunities as well. Yeah, um, uh, PSL 2 final, you mentioned, uh, you, Dylan Samuel, other people who come for Pakistan for the first time, and that was a very quieter, uh, you know, moment for Pakistan international cricket. So from that time when uh, not many people were doing Pakistan, you were one of them, to now in playing Pakistan for the bilateral series, of, it's a long journey. How do you remember that PSL 2 final memories and that time, and that, that was a very special moment for Pakistan because it's the one match that actually lead to the revival of cricket. Yeah, I, I don't think at the time any of us thought how um, important it would have been for Pakistan cricket um, for us um, to come over here and play that final in Lahore. Um, it was a fantastic occasion. It was, you know, brilliant to come and see, um, you know, cricket in Pakistan. And I don't think any of us thought that us coming over would have played such a big part in, in cricket coming back to Pakistan. So it's a special moment for myself and for the other three guys that were part of that. Um, and it is great to see cricket back in Pakistan. It's it's a cricket loving nation um, you know who were starved of their star players playing in the green for a long time um, and also the, um, the overseas players not being available or overseas teams so to, to, to play a small part in that has been very special um, you know and I'm honored to have been given that opportunity by by Pakistan cricket to be part of that uh, David uh, talk us through the season of the hundred the way you played for Trent Rockets and went on to win the tournament especially the way you striking the ball, uh, your power hitting abilities, uh, I noticed that improved a lot. So, um, just talk us through about your power hitting and uh, the recent form of the 100. Yeah, it was good. Uh, nice to win the tournament, nice to get some runs as well. Um, I wouldn't say my power hitting's improved, it's it's always been there. Um, you know, you play different roles in different teams and you, you do what you're asked to do. Um, around that but it was nice to have the freedom to go back to open the batting you know since i've started batting three for england every tournament and every place i've batting i bat three four five in these tournaments so um, which is obviously a different role you're coming in different situations whereas when you open the batting you play the same way every single game um which allows you to practice that way and approach that game you're not worried about if you've already lost two wickets and you have to take the game deeper or different conditions and different situations so um, it allowed me to just go out and play how i want to play um instead of maybe thinking too much about a situation and about us getting to a score that's going to be competitive. David, uh, talking about PSL again, it must have provided you an opportunity to, you know, to, to understand uh, what sort of challenge 
uh, you would face uh, you would face in Pakistan to know about the conditions to know about the players. So, any conversations in this court about I mean you, from your experiences of PSL and what sort of challenge you are expecting from Pakistan side in their territory? Yeah, uh, Pakistan out here are a fantastic team. To be fair, they're a fantastic team everywhere. They've got all the bases covered. Um, you know, for many of us, this is our first time in Pakistan. For others, we've been here uh, a couple of times. So it's about us sharing that experience about the wickets and the conditions that we can come up with, uh, trying to give as much knowledge as we can to the rest of the guys that haven't been here. Um, they are slightly different wickets. Um, you know, Lahore is different to this one. This one could be quite skiddy. Uh, whereas Lahore can be a bit more bouncy and, and, and a bit more sticky. Um, so it's given that knowledge, making sure we prepare accordingly. Um, but look, it's always a challenge playing against Pakistan. Um, you know, and I think this is going to be exactly the same. Thanks all. We'll leave that there. Um, thank you for your questions.